Hey everyone, this is Miranda from Diamond Painting with the Besties. How are you? I hope everyone's doing well. Today we have a post review. Now, I'm sorry I didn't get this done earlier today. This is uh, it's Thursday right now, so you guys are gonna see this tomorrow, uh, Friday morning. I was trying to do the post review with the natural sunlight, but we're trying to get ready to um, go out of town and swim and everything above that. Um, I have just finally gotten to it. So here is my finished canvas. This is Shine On by Lizzie Falcon from Treasure Studios Art. It is a 60 by 80 round. I got her in the biggest size they offered. I outlined it with some awesome um, rainbow washi that I got from Amanda Michelle, which I'll link her website. Uh, she used to be on Etsy. Etsy. She has just now started her own website. So I will link that below as well as this kit. And let me tell you, this was so much fun to work on. It did not come with any ABs. However, I ordered as many as possible that I could find matches for from uh, DP with Sparklers, so Tima. And I'll list DP with Sparklers down below as well. And I blinged her out the best way possible. And let me see if this other light will help or if it will hinder. So let's see. Oh, and somebody turned the light off. So that's awesome. Hold on, let me see. Stand by. Okay, I'm back. So it didn't really make a difference as far as the sunshine or trying to show the ABs, but I'll just point out. So we have seven, four, a lot of the yellows, the 742, the 743, uh, things like that. So, and these blues, so all up at the top, I blinged out all down here and sorry for my gapping, but, um. I was excited about multi-placing. So all in here, there's all ABs. There's a, I didn't do as many down here as normally. Um, there are a few purple ABs down in here, some of the 797, but the most where I concentrated was up around her at the top. Um, I did do some with the green highlight up in her crown and throughout her hair. I did put a lot of ABs and obviously all up in her eye and her eyeshadow. I did under her nose a little bit and around her face. Now, I did not put very many ABs in her face because I didn't want it to look um, weird or anything. So I just kind of highlighted a little bit, like some highlighter if she had a brush and did that. So I'm gonna try my best to bring it up to show you guys some more where to see if you can but look you guys can see that shine she's so sparkly just stunning even down to the angle of her nose the rendering was absolutely perfect there's not one thing that i disliked about this kit or anything negative to say i will say this was my first time with a mounted glue and I did struggle a bit and it made me a little bit more focused and concentrate on where I placed my drills because trying to move them was really, really difficult as of course of being uh, poured glue. So let me see if I can try and bring her in so you guys can see, oh, there. Can you guys see in her hair, the AB? Look at that sparkle right there. And I'm, again, I'm apologizing if it looks a little wonky, but this canvas is large and it gets heavy when you put these drills on. I wanted to do this post review early, earlier so I could take this over to Hobby Lobby and, or try and find a frame for it. But um, I did find a conversion chart, so maybe I can just eyeball it and get a frame. But what do you guys think? Isn't she absolutely stunning? I'm so excited. I think that she's so beautiful. What do you guys think? Leave me a comment. This was so much fun. If you guys are on the fence about whether you've never ordered from the company before or how uh, Lizzie Falcon's artwork will turn out once the kit is completed, let me tell you, I am so happy that I have a lot more Lizzie in my stash. So happy because this is beautiful and it looks beautiful when I'm looking at it but when I see it in the camera like 
it's even more stunning. You can actually see, like here I can't really see the glow, but in the, in the camera, I can see the glow coming up from her shoulders, her bodice to her shoulders. And I just love it. They did an amazing job, the rendering, everything. As far as trash, like I maybe had a few chipped drills, but other than that, my trash was just um, drills that I was too lazy to put back in the bag when I found them floating around on my canvas. To be honest with you guys, that's it. So I'm really excited to get this frame and get this up in my craft room and excited to see when the natural light hits it. Um, you can't really tell even by the photos that I've posted, but I just wanted to share this with you guys um, real quick before we head out because I'm gonna kind of go on like a little hiatus. I'll get you have some stuff to get you through the weekend, but I was going to spend time with my parents. I haven't seen them in three years. But you guys didn't come here to hear about Miranda's uh, family. You came to see this post review of Shine On. And another reason why I like her so much, besides the rainbow, obviously, because the rainbow has a significant meaning because my daughter is part of the LGBTQI plus community. And I do everything I possibly can to support her and empower her and, and uplift her. But her crown reminds me of the Statue of Liberty. I'm from New York. So anything that even slightly resembles or gives me that feeling about New York, I'm gonna get. And I know I've mentioned that previously. Now I will also put up in the eye the unboxing of this so you guys can see what it looked like prior to me starting if you had not seen this before and now you can see this. All right, well, oh, the drills. So I had a ton left over. So I used my awesome Bell Art Dinicole kit that I love so much because I am team baggy. And I had a ton, like this is 742. I had all the 742 left. Um, I did, you know, this was the extent of me running out or looking like I was running out, um, you know, a little bit there, but that's still plenty. It's actually more, more than meets the eye, more than we think that it is. Um, these are some of the ABs I used, um, right here. A lot of the greens, the greens were so amazing. I used some AB white, but, um. So here are some of the colors that were, like what I have left from those. You know, a little bit of this left. The colors are so bright and vibrant. Um, so yeah, I did not, realistically, I didn't even come close to running out, even though I was like, Ugh, I don't know, but that's always the case. So Treasure Studios Arts gives you tons and tons of drills left over. So I will be able to add those in my little uh, D-stash binders that I have. So yeah. All right, you guys. Well, I hope you have a fabulous uh, weekend and happy Friday. And I'll talk to you later. So make sure you stay safe and be kind. Bye.